We've reached our first American written song on the list. This 1868 text was written by Philip Brooks. The carol is popular on both sides of the Atlantic, but to different tunes. In America to St. Louis, written by Brooks's collaborator, Lewis Redner. And in the UK, it's sung to the tune Forest Green, which is a tune that was adapted by Ralph Vaughan Williams. And it was adapted from an old English folk ballad called The Plowboy's Dream. Redner recounts the following. On the Saturday previous, the Saturday night previous, my brain was all confused about the tune. I thought more about my Sunday school lesson than I did about the music. But I was roused from sleep late in the night, hearing an angel strain whispering in my ear. And seizing a piece of music paper, I jotted down the treble of the tune as we now have it. And on Sunday morning, before going to church, I filled in the harmony. Neither Mr. Brooks nor I ever thought the carol or the music to it would live beyond that Christmas of 1868. For my UK friends, this is that tune. And these wonderful words, how silently, how silently the wondrous gift is given. So God imparts to human hearts the blessings of his heaven. No ear may hear his coming, but in this world of sin, where meek souls will receive him still, the dear Christ enters in. Enjoy the little town of Bethlehem. Still we see the light above thy deep and dreamless sleep. The silent stars go by, yet in thy dark streets shine the everlasting light. The hopes and fears of all the years are met in thee tonight. For Christ is born of Mary and gathered all Descend on us, we pray. 
cast out our sin and enter in, be born in us today. We hear the Christmas angels, the great glad tidings tell. Oh, come to us, abide in us, our Lord.